Good morning, Kamehameha. Today is Wednesday, May 11th. I'm Braden Santiago. My name is Kolomona Kahanui. Thank you for watching us. Here to bring us today's prayer is Clarissa. Let's bow our heads in prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, please bless us as we finish up one of our last days at school. We thank you for all the blessings that you've bestowed upon us and keep us safe throughout the rest of the day. Amen. Thank you, Clarissa, for our prayer. Today's Olala no Eau is Hepiha Ekelo, meaning minor bird. Use this phrase whenever you encounter someone who chatters a lot but doesn't really say anything. Today in 1899, the Hawaii Board of Education abolishes fees for attending public schools in the Hawaiian Islands. And now for today's announcements. Donation, donation, donation. If you're feeling generous, donate your old clothes for the homeless. Donations will be collected at Paki 201 or Paki 302. Don't forget to donate. You there, we children. Don't forget to return your laptops. See the daily bulletin for details. And on Friday, Friday, don't forget to pick up your yearbooks on Friday. You can also watch me embarrass myself when I sing a few songs for the social. Attention seniors, we have a Colosseum on Friday. If you didn't do your post high school survey, get on it. It's a graduation requirement. See the daily bulletin for details. Attention juniors, there are no announcements concerning your class in the daily bulletin. Sophomores, come to Bishop 200 today or tomorrow to order your class rings. Freshmen, leadership board positions are still available. See daily bulletin for details. Speaking of leadership, let's follow Braden Santiago as he investigates as to why Spirit Week was canceled this semester. <laughs> Here at Kamehameha, students are constantly busy with homework and numerous school activities. It's no wonder why many students look forward to relieving their stress at various school activities. One of Kamehameha's famous school activities, Spirit Week, was cancelled by school officials due to failure to submit important paperwork. Though the activity had already occurred during the first semester, it was a tremendous success. The student body, as well as student leaders, proposed the idea to do another one during the second semester. Unfortunately, it fell through the cracks. We asked students how they felt about Spirit Week. So, like, school is more fun. It feels like high school. It's not like the prison that we're in. And I don't know, it's, it's a better way of just kind of expressing yourself through different clothing and activities that they have. Planning student activities isn't an easy process here at Kamehameha Schools. There's a tremendous amount of paperwork and many administrators to see in order to plan something fun for your fellow peers. We had a chance to interview with student body leaders to see how they were planning Spirit Week and why it didn't go through. Um, it was kind of last minute planning and A team doesn't like it when you take two th th things to them and it's not completely planned out. So they pretty much just told us, no, this is too last minute, you can't, you can't do this and we wanted to have like dress up days and the dress up days are cancelled because there was enough planning behind it. Students can only hope that next school year there will actually be a spirit week. There is no doubt that next year's student council board can do the job. Reporting from the Kamehameha High School campus, my name is Braden Santiago. Mahalo to Clarissa, Kinui, and myself for producing that fascinating story. And in Lost and Found, Smith Office has a few Lost and Found items. Please stop by if you've lost an item. That's all for today's announcements. Tomorrow is a sea day schedule. And the delectable course for tomorrow's lunch is teriyaki meatball. Again. Have a great day, everyone. I'm Brayden. And I'm Kolo. Starburst. 
hits a juicy contradiction.